Hello guys, welcome back to third video, so soon. Today we'll be reviewing the T-Rex Breakout. Now, I think it's pretty cool because it comes with four things, including the goggles. But I say the Scorpio Strix Danger Pack is pretty cool because it's cooler because um, it has a Scorpius. Now, this is from the original Jurassic Park. The T-Rex is breaking out of fencing again the cars so right here we got Tim his yellowish orange hair um a blue shirt like the well, sweatshirt kind of red and white on the inside and a purple necktie his arms can go all the way around now his can't go like this like with most figures they can't go like that they just stay down and with the legs pretty same Go at the knee, go up, back. Yeah. Compare him to Kenji, standing upright. Um, if Kenji will stand, cause he's kind of hard to stand. And then you get Tim in the shot. And yeah, so comparison. There, he, he's pretty tiny. I wish it came like with an Alan Grant. So. That would make it so good. On to the goggles. Sorry, T-Rex. You gotta close your mouth. The goggles are pretty simple. Sorry, Tom. They're nice green with a little headpiece. Um, a light, nice yellow and a little bit of, like, detailing on it. Let's go with the goggles and Tim. Now on to the car, which I think is probably the best out of this set. With the T-Rex. Um, so on the front, we got... Two little headlamps. Well, I should probably go straight. Guys, one like it. Two little headlamps. A nice like barbed wire. Has this little thing down here. If I can look at it. Kind of just more headlights. There's two stickers. The head headlamp and the orange one with some vents, which actually look cool. The front is Jurassic Park. It, it actually says. Um, the backwards on my phone, which I'm doing it on. I'm just gonna look at the front now. It has a nice clear glass. The top can go like this, of course, in the original movie. So it's like the T-Rex is trying to break down. And if you're wondering why there's some smudge on it, you can see that it came with the set for some reason, so it's like someone was playing with it. The back half of the top, actually also there's this thing, which I don't like, and also this, this whole thing, whole thing is a sticker. So, right here, there's three little headlamps, on the, on the back there's more glass, and onto the back. The back is pretty cool too, this one, this part right here says explore, this says, um, zero four dress park, um, more of a sticker. Right here. It goes all the way around, I think. I don't know. Maybe I'm not on the doors. And the glass is nice, nice and clear. You can't open the back, which I thought would have been cool. And they could add, like, a box with a flare and a flashlight in it, which I think would have been the best. Okay. Now, on the inside, uh, okay, we got to do the undercarriage first. Undercarriage is pretty simple. It's um, just, like, anything on a regular car. Now, this video also might be shorter. Because I had really fun unboxing, not unboxing, but reviewing the Scorpius Rex Danger Pack. So this might be a little bit shorter. Like my first video, it was a little bit shorter, but it should be okay. Alright, and what I love, 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 love about this set is watch this. The doors open for once. We haven't seen many opening door vehicles, but with this one... But the other car that's in the Jurassic Park franchise, I gotta, I, I gotta move this T-Rex. It takes up the whole table. What the best say. So yeah, it's pretty same. It, it's way shorter. Shorter by like the back. And yeah. So I do have the other one, the first one, the first Jeep Wrangler that came out, but I really don't know where it is. I'm gonna assume that's somewhere. Now that we're done with these things, on to the big bad girl. Let's see, 
This is Rexy, a girl. People keep thinking that she's a boy. I don't, I don't think she is. Because in, in the Lost World, there's there's a T-Rex with like a slimmer cut. It doesn't really have much. All right. So now, on to the Rex. It's your usual Rexy. The one in Camp Cretaceous is huge. Like its head is twice the size of Rexy's. And that's the same T-Rex. I see it, but like, it's very huge. All right, it has a yellow eye, stylish brown, stylish brown paint right here. I can reach it, because I'm looking at the camera and the T-Rex at the same time. Um, it has these little ridges on top, like an usual dress park T-Rex. Um, it kind of has whitish yellow teeth. Inside of the mouth, there's a button on top that you can press. See that? Inside has a like fl flexible tongue, kind of. Um, in the back, you can actually see the joint. I think we're okay. Yeah, we're okay. I thought. So, yeah, I wish they would fix that. Moving on to the back. It has a nice brown paint, so I'm gonna move this one. It's a nice brown paint. Back. Of course, it has its tiny baby arms, which are still not painted. Why won't Mattel paint paint stuff? Like it's so easy. Look, look at the circus suit. This no painted toenails, but for T-Rex they are. Maybe they just do bigger ones. They got sponge doors and then diamond tracks. Maybe bigger ones. And then of course onto the legs. Usual typical T-Rex legs. The tail can go like this. And that's pretty much everything in the set. But what I did not get in the last video is the scan code. You guys are probably like, why did he not do the scan code? But now I'll do it. So here's the Rex scan code. You guys love that. I don't think many people in the world have this. Hope I get a lot of views. Here's also the Scorpius that we didn't do last time. Just the one we unboxed yesterday. Which I'm surprised that some of you actually watched it. I got 107 views, I think, on my first video. So people must be watching my stuff. Maybe there's a subscribe button and see a notification. Alright, there's the scan code. And I don't know what time this video will be out. It might take a while because I still gotta upload and stuff. But I hope you guys have had a great day. Um, like and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Bye.